that's good visibility. Hello, and welcome to the show. This is Webmaster Paul for Freshwater Diver One. In 400 yards, please turn slight right.
What have they found, I wonder? <laughs> Good enough, I guess, What depth did you get? Seven meter. Seven. Uh, got to that third board. These three line here. I've got to the third one. Yeah. This building was horrendous. It's seven. Mm. Um, My new looks on that might be there. all the way across then. It was rubbish. Worriedly, worriedly. Um, oh, found a mask. How's that, mate? How's that on it? Yeah. Hey, that's it. How much, eh? 150. Yeah. yeah. He got same. Oh, and you were above me, Darren, weren't you? Probably just. Hang on, were you above me? I'm not yes. gonna breathe next time then. Always <laughs> above me, never below me. <laughs> Big competition on air this one. <laughs> Thought you that'll get you something good. <laughs> just need a clean up now. You just say bear, not bearing back in, that's what you can it do. Was, it was, just compass in front of you all the time, wherever you're going, mate. <laughs> yeah. No, no. That's something really. <laughs> no, it's like, on some spots you can actually navigate, can't you? On there, you, you, you go, you just... Mm -hmm. You go in, in and out while just doing boxes. It was a dive. Mm -hmm. We got wet, that's the main thing. Shame, well, it, wasn't, that... shame it wasn't clearer. No, I, I enjoyed it. It's good. Yeah, that's right, because then there's a millennium. Oh, that came in. We only had about three or four lakes on at that time, you know. Yeah. You think if you, the only thing about up here is not enough diving, is it? People don't dive up here. You don't dive constantly, you know what I mean? It's, it's all, mm. It seems to be like a, a dying sort of thing now, isn't it? I don't know, there's still a lot of people come up like diving. Yeah. yeah. We've only got 50 in our club. And you think about it, you should have loads. There's lots of divers in there. You've got about 10 regular divers, haven't we? Yeah. yeah that's like, you went that's to the, like what we had, eh? You need, you, you want yeah. a lot more people there, then you can start looking at new things and doing different things. I think just now as well, it's sort of the economy as well, you know, yeah, just in the cost of fuel and stuff. It's not, to it's, out. Not, it's not cheap to dive. Especially if you go in the rib. <laughs> well, we can't get out of out because of it. the engines looking, aren't they? Yeah. So if you yeah, like that, that puts it down as well for people because yeah. there's no rib. Yeah. You got health and safety now, you? Have, have, have all the mini training qualifications. No. There's plenty of people coming through, like young ones, but they, they don't seem to follow it up once they've got the qualification, do they? No. But it's, to me, it's buying the equipment, and that's where it falls down because it costs a lot to buy the equipment. Mm. I don't think there's going to be any, any uh, easy way around that. Well, it's not and, as if, uh, we, well, I was even saying, what about buying like, equipment? I said use. that, it's a bit like golfing though. You know your golf clubs, yeah. set, a full set of them. So once, you, once you bought them, you green got, fees. It's like, it's just like it's getting them. Yeah, it's like diving, once you've got, once you've got the gear, it's virtually free, isn't it? Yeah. Just your, just your fuel. Mm. Well, it's oh, it's right, good if it's two years, I mean, you share the petrol, you know. Oh, yeah. A little easier that way, like. Mm. Yeah. 
It's, 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 it's literally ten minutes hours. to where we drive at college at the moment. Yeah. Well, it gets What's a mucky lake when you start pumping around? <laughs> oh, it is. It's clearer than that, though. <laughs> I'm saying that, that's, oh, been up, that's been stirred up a lot today, hasn't it? Yeah. It's, it's just true, it's been such bad weather for such a long time now as well. It's just hopeless. But everything washes up to the end anyway, so yeah. it'll be all sorts Yeah. Well, there. only because the, the wind's blowing this way today. Well, you say it's, you see the gaps and that, but it's like, I've been hands in a few times, but I just didn't want to stir the visit up any more than what it was already. <laughs> Well, what's the thing when, when God himself went, went in watching? I mean, that was it. You're not seeing nothing. Mm. <laughs> and if I wanted to find him, I'd either rise up maybe three metres or go off to the left, or whichever side I was on. Yeah. If I was on his left side, I'd go off to the left at an angle and then torch on to see where the actual blooms Cloud of work. silt, where he's been travelling along, follow them along. But then God was such a fast thinner. Because when we were travelling fast under there, your, your hoses were vibrating as we were in, you know. Going for it. <laughs> yeah. That's the only thing that scared me of God. I mean, he's got to such a speed. You, I don't remember the first time on the TV, things was shaking like this. Like, like that. Damn hell. <laughs> This is Webmaster Paul for Freshwater Diver One on YouTube. Thank you for your likes and subscribes, they're much appreciated. We'll be uploading videos every Friday. See you next Friday.